What's going on, YouTubers and YouTubettes out there in YouTube land? I'm coming to you with another video of a bunch of stuff that I recently got in. Let me fix them, man. Look a little odd here. But, um, all right, let's jump right in. I want to thank everyone who watched my last video. I do appreciate it. I know it was a long time waiting for it, and I hope I didn't too much disappoint you. Um, kind of felt good to get back into it, and now I'm going to do this one. So I'm going to start with Larry McWilliams. I sent him four cards, and he always just signs one. Uh, and he takes a long-ass time. I think this one took like a year, year and a half. He signed my 87 Flair. Next, this is an individual pitcher for the... I know him for the Oakland Athletics. I have sent to him like five times, and I got an RTS every single time. Finally, I got a good address on him. And he signed three at three, and really fast, actually. It's Rich Harden. On the ace. He was a great pitcher. And so I think he hurt his arm. But yep. Next I sent to the minor leagues. This guy Randy Red. For the Washington Nationals. I forget where I sent it. But he signed that one. That one took about six months from spring training. Randy Mc... Cement. Cement. This, I don't know why some individuals take so long, but he is always a slow signer. This one almost took two years, and he signed one. I had one card of him. I just had to get it out so I can be done with them. Uh, Bill Wegman sent them five cards. I usually don't send five cards. He usually sends back a Bible card, but this time he didn't, but he did send along his pamphlet that he likes to send along. But he has a quick signature, a quick uh, BW, and... Believe me, he signed five. He always will sign whatever you send him and super fast because he wants to get his Bible message out there. Next, Dick Schofield Jr. Signed three or three. I got a bowling success because they bowl with balls. Uh, Don Moser. He signed three or three. This was a bunch of cards I had sent out about two, two and a half years ago and... He was an RTS, and I finally came across it and said, well, let me find an address, and I found one, and he signed right away. Next, uh, former Giants linebacker Justin Tuck found a home addy for him. He signed it in pen, a quick JT line, 91. Next, Bob Brower, Browner, signed one of one, and I don't know if I can have anything to show you. Let me see. On all my letters and so forth, I always put a smiley face on my outgoing, my incoming, my saves, and my letters. And he kind of copied me. He put a little smiley face down by his name right there. So if you ever see my autograph pop up online anyway, make sure it has the smiley face because it's added on. Don Easer, sign three to three. Next, Agi uh, 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 oh, Bob Oh, here. Sign one of one. That one took about a year and a half. I sent to the team. I forget which team, so. Next, I was actually a big fan of this guy growing up. Rance Mullenix in his beautiful swing. Next, Matt Lejos. He's sent this to the AAA team. He's trying to make his comeback. He signed one of one in seriously about seven days. Let me see what else. Bob Benoit, another bowling success. Signed that one. Two. He signed two, kept one. Bastard. Like he needs more bowling cards. Next Olympic wrestler, Adeline Gray. Signed one of one. Sorry for the glare. I've been putting them in penny sleeves for storage instead of binders. Trying to save some room. PJ Camasio, a uh, former NBA coach. I think, was it with the Warriors? He kind of got choked out by Sprewell. I think so. Next, this one was an interesting. Chris Davis, AAA pitcher for the Red Sox. Took him like a year and a half. I, was, I kept going, trying to find him in my spreadsheets. I was like, Where I, who the hell takes a year and a half for him? Next, this cost me 10 bucks, 5 bucks a card. Uh, NHL Hall of Famer, Maurice Dion. Sign one. 
and another one and cool thing sent his own certificate of authenticity with it i'll file that right away next phil bradley signed 404 all in pen i think if you pay through past pros you get a sharpie one so keep that in mind you'll Lo Maria Sanchez, Lamar, sign one of one. And this one, these took three years. No, five years, three years, and one year. Joe Torrey. Signed a bunch for me, but I got them all back on the same day. And I sent them five years ago, three years ago, and a year ago. So I guess he was catching up on his mail. Uh, I think a bunch of the stuff I actually showed off in my last video, but I'm kind of guessing here. Next, uh, George Solar. I, I suck at names, you know that. First 40 home run hitter for the Royals this year. He signed two or two. And this one, I sent it to a top secret location, and I got it back in three weeks. Recently retired Troy Trulowitzki, sign one and sign two. And all right, I'm just gonna keep it at that for right now. Hope everyone's doing well. Uh, let me just do these so I can get these out of the way. Brett Gates, sign two or two in gold. Funny thing, I was at his first major league hit game at Fenway Park when he played for o Oakland, and he's this one signed four four Joe Solesky. Skarsiski signed 4-4. Four, four. I filed the other one away. Alright, hope everyone's doing well. I'm just trying to make this shorter than my other ones. Um, I'm sorry. I didn't look up all the other pronunciations and names. I know Troy does that, but I don't have that much time and I would forget them by the time I do this video. Alright, hope everyone's doing well and um, make sure you watch Autographers, Autographers Anonymous um, on podcasts. Go to the website, go to the Facebook page, and every other place you just look up Autographers Anonymous. And you'll listen to the podcast and watch them. And I believe there's one tomorrow night. Got postponed for a week. I'm really hoping to try to make this one. But, you know, kids, family, rugrats have to play their sports. All right, hope everyone's doing well. Bye.